So, in animals the movement can be for protection, for food, for mating. But how does it pick the changes in the environment? What is it that helps us to pick the stimuli from the environment? What is a stimulus? Stimulus you can say is a change in the environment. It is a situation. Now, in when you are in the playground and if your house has won or when India wins and you are in front of TV, you shout. Even your umpire shouts, how is it? Do you shout like this in your classroom? You do not, you whisper. Who tells you to do this? These are some of the things that are being coordinated. How? That is the question. There is a special type of tissue, the nervous tissue, which is made up of a network of nerve cells, which are also called neuron, the unit of nervous system. The structure of a neuron is very interesting. It is in made in such a way that it can pick stimuli. It has a large rounded body which is called cell body or the cyton. Now, you must be wondering why these gaps? These are the branches that occur from the cyton. These branches are called dendrons and their further branches are called dendrites. So, these are the dendrites. You must have rightly guessed it is the dendrites that pick up the stimuli. The cyton has a large nucleus, lot of cytoplasm. all cell organelles except one, the centriole. So, what is the result? It cannot divide. That is why if a nerve cell is damaged, it can neither be replaced nor repaired. It is just a total loss. So, my dear nerve cells are very important. This cyton is continued as a cytoplasmic process called exon. The cell membrane of exon is called exolemma. This whole thing is covered by a sheath. Actually, this is exo, uh, exon and this is exolemma and it is covered by a sheath which is called neurilemma. Some neurons have another covering in between which is called myelin sheath. But all neurons do not all have myelin sheath. After a little interval, there is an area which is without myelin sheath and that is called Ranvier's node. And finally, it ends up in a gland or a muscle. This is the terminal end. There is nuclei even in the exon, right. Now, here there are ribosomes which have proteins called nissel granules. So, the impulse or you can say the stimuli is picked up by the dendrite. 